one of the things that I think that is um, cool and really notable about Jim is that he he will he's always trying to find what is funnier what is you know there, there's there's sort of uh, never a desire there's always a sort of hunger to to keep uh, finding what the new thing is and and uh, and taking it to that next level and seeing if that works and and uh, and that's a really fun thing to to be able to play with and collaborate with and they like it very cold uh, I've decided that I'd also like people to come around and say Carly Gugino works best starting around 11 a.m. when it's 72 degrees uh, you know because with the penguins it's like they work their best when it's 39 we can go up to 41 so our sets are freezing um, and I'm not good in the cold so that's I have that one that's my only pet peeve about the penguins otherwise they're amazing I mean you know they, they don't they don't do a lot they don't follow direction that well um, but you cannot stand next to them and, and not smile. I mean, they're just such little forces of joy. It's in New York City. It's um, it's such an adventure. It's also a love story. It's also a, a, a flat-out comedy. Um, and it also has very human elements that are, I think, the struggle that all people have, which is how do you balance your work and your life and your family and all of those things, you know? Um, but mostly, I think it's going to be just what I think of, what I think of as a popcorn movie, which is not, is, you know, I always feel like, some people feel like, oh, popcorn movies are like mindless entertainment. I never think that. I just think a popcorn movie is that kind of movie that I'm there with my popcorn, I'm totally into it the whole time, I have a smile sort of on my face, and then all of a sudden the movie is done, and I'm like, how did that happen? How did it go so fast?